Hey y'all, Crystal with MrsHappyHomemaker.com and I am coming from you in a motel room in the middle of the Peaches to Beaches yard sale, a 240 mile plus yard sale that my son and I do every year together. Um, I'm in my pajamas, just got out of the shower and I'm about to show you one of the ways that we save money when we're traveling and doing fun adventures like this. So here I have got some of my ingredients that I am going to use to make um, some really great nachos, I think. And so this is what I'm doing. I bought some Tostito scoops and some Doritos from the Dollar General down the road. I brought some leftover shredded beef from the house. This is my uh, banana pepper beef, but it's listed on my website as pepperoncini beef. I just used banana peppers uh, can that I grew from my garden last, or last year instead of that. So I've got that. I have got some leftover uh, spicy ranch sauce that I got with some fried green tomatoes at the Whistle Stop Cafe yesterday in Juliet, Georgia, as seen on the movie Fried Green Tomatoes. And I've got some cheeses here. I brought some leftover uh, rattlesnake cheddar from the house. And I brought some of this cheese from the house with me. This is some habanero jack that I bought. And I'm going to be gone for a good little bit. And I don't want my nice cheeses to go away. So, I brought that. Um, I usually bring a chef's knife, but I did not this time. So, um, so first, I'm going to take this uh, leftover beef that I brought from the house. And I'm going to put it in the microwave. And I'm going to heat it up so it's nice and warm before I put it on top of the chips. And put it to finish in my air fryer with the cheese. Now, another thing I always travel with is... Plastic silverware. You never, never know when you might need it. So I've got some Tostito scoops and some uh, Flamin' Hot Doritos inside my air fryer. My son picked out the Flamin' Hot Doritos. I might, uh, I'm gonna try them, but I might stick with tortilla chips. We'll see. Anyhow, I got this in my uh, air fryer and I'm gonna top them with my warmed up pepper city beef or banana pepper beef. So now I have my leftover shredded beef that I brought from home piled high on top of the tortilla chips that I put in here. And now I'm gonna top it with some of this sliced cheese. I have sliced up the cheese that I brought from home and I have topped my uh, shredded beef nachos with it in the air fryer and I am gonna take it up and I am gonna cook it. So I'm gonna put it on power 370 and let me check it on in eight minutes and see what it looks like. So I ended up taking these out at six minutes instead of eight and the cheese is perfectly hot and melted. So now I have drizzled that leftover sauce that we got with our fried green tomatoes from the restaurant yesterday and we are going to eat these nachos. Ethan, what do you think about the nachos that I made? Delicious. Delicious? <laughs> They're really good y'all, like really good. We have devoured the entire thing of them. Now I gotta wash my air fryer.